Quick 9.2 impressions. New zone looks great. New raid looks cool. Two times legendaries with progression in Zerith Maltus, not Torghast plus class sets will be very fun. As I've already said, this is sad to me. Arnold, by the way, thank you for the gifted stuff. Did really appreciate that. Thank you, thank you, thank you, brother. Um, I don't mind the fact that legendaries are being removed from Torghast. Good job, right? Soul Ash shouldn't be in Torghast. I mind the fact that Torghast is basically now going away. Uh, fatigued by Shadowlands setting. Not much faith in storytelling. Class sets look uh, kind of look like leveling gear. I will admit, how many of you are? How many of you looked at the tier sets and and found them adequate? Like found yourself excited for the tier sets? Blue fairy, how are you doing? They look kind of shit. Like let me let me let me show you guys. Because I'm not actually all that... I'm not actually all that fucking excited for it. Um, the, where where are your tier sets? Um, so many new things. So many new things. So many new things. Where are your tier sets? It's not this one. Can someone give me the link to the fucking tier sets? It's just tier sets. No connection with classes. Gab, yeah, yes, but I mean... Tier sets used to be class sets, right? Because every class has its own tier set bonus, if you will, right? Um, so technically it is sort of class sets because, you know, every class is supposed to have their own tier set. Um, King Julian, that's a fucking stupid argument. You got what you wanted, just move on. If I didn't, if I got what I wanted, I would be happy. I'm not happy. So I clearly didn't get what I want. Okay, here you go. Now... This, to me, I, I, I'm not sure why I should be excited for this. I'm, I'm genuinely not sure why I should be excited for this. Because it doesn't... I miss the days of gear being special, dude. I miss the days of gear actually looking good. Um, nothing about this seems... Um, seems great. King Julian, that's bullshit. Saying, oh, you should praise them when you get what you want, even if it isn't what you want, but at least it's somewhat what you want. It's in the same fucking street as what you want. So you should praise them, otherwise they won't be incentivized. No! They will not be incentivized to give me what I want if I just fucking praise them for things that I didn't ask for, but yet I got somewhat what I wanted. Yes, I got tier sets. Checked. I got it looking stupid as fuck. Check. So, of course, I can still complain about it. Of course I'm allowed to complain about it. Th th literally, that is the, the reason you are allowed to complain. When you get something that you want, but you don't get exactly what you want, you're allowed to complain about that. I need to fix this right now. Fuck that. I need to fix this right now. Anyways, uh, so yeah, the, the tier sets, it's great that there is tier sets. It's not great that the tier sets don't look great. Um, where in the fuck did Michael's... I hate I hate Twitter so much. I don't care about any of this shit. I'm gonna have to unfollow a bunch of people again because I'm getting political crap on my Twitter again that I don't fucking care for. Here we go. Alright, let's just click on this and have it there. Bro, can people who I follow stop liking political crap so that I don't have to fucking read political shit on my Twitter? Um, that would be great. So, yeah, from, from a looks perspective, not the end of the world, but not great either, right? Um, so, benefits from 915, no renown bar, extra soul binds is great, as is Zian being built from the start with alt friendliness. Um, we'll need to see what the cipher system is like and if the world content is fun to engage in, unlike Hothia. Uh, true. Personally, th I think the, um, the thing that bothers me most about the cipher system is, uh, depending on how Blizzard implements the Cypher system, I can very easily see the Cypher system turn into the biggest time gate of them all, right? Where you can't actually continue with the story of Zerith Maltus until your X number of research in, and that research takes weeks uh, to actually get to that number before you can continue with the story, because they did say there's no extra renown. Instead, the Cypher system is taking the place of the renown bar. So we could very easily see the story again be time-gated to fuck on top of this sort of research system that you're thrown into, which I think is is just, that's going to feel miserable. And my main reason for thinking it's going to feel miserable is not everyone cares about the rune system, right? 
not everyone wants to decipher the runes. Not everyone is a fucking nerd like myself who, you know, really want to know what the language of the first ones is. There are some people who just don't give a fuck about that. And they're going to be forced to do this as well because the story is hidden behind these runes, right? The end result of the zone is hidden behind these runes and they, they're sort of going to be forced to do it, which I hate. And again, proves that Blizzard doesn't actually pay attention, but we'll have to see if that is how it plays out. For many, that'll mean a skip. For those who stay around, it'll probably mean WoW Shadowlands at its best, pumped with new content and mostly free of the frustrations. Uh, we'll see. We'll see. I think a lot of people are going to skip. Um, at least in my community, I can see a shit ton of people skipping. Um, I, I, I've, I've heard from a lot of you that, that many of you are not really interested in playing right now. So it, I guess, you know. Wait, the video is at 50-50 dislikes, likes? If there was ever proof that the community is now divided as fuck on World of Warcraft, that would be it. Oof. Holy fuck. Uh, Snowball, how are you doing? Is this crypto channel? Uh, no, not really. It's whatever fucking channel we want to talk about. I'll, I'll say what's more sort of weird to me, what's more weird to me about all of this is only 500,000 views in the last day. Flape, how you doing, bro? That, I think, is, is a little bit strange. Only 500,000 views in the last day. 13,000 likes, 13,000 dislikes. That is, that is, I think, telling. It's, it's telling to me that there's so few people actually watching this video. I mean, this is the 9.2 release trailer, right? This is the moment that people have been waiting for. The, especially after Shadowlands and how Shadowlands have been going, one would expect that there would be millions of people watching right now. Just sort of, you know, wanting to see, is it worth getting back into? The fact that there's only 500,000 people who watched it suggests to me that maybe there's not that many people who really give a fuck anymore. You know, and I'm not saying that, that World of Warcraft is always going to get mo hundreds of millions of views. Because that's not actually the case, right? That That isn't actually the case. We can actually look here... Um, uh, so many crap things that they upload. But let's quickly see what was their previous views like for some big announcement that was in the fucking MDI or um, well, the Arena Championships. Um, Corthia preview only got 43. So I suppose actually that's not a bad thing. Never mind. But this is actually good views. Considering the Corthia Chains of the Nation preview only got 43k views. And Chains of Domination only got 375k views. I'm wrong, actually. It seems like 500,000 is the best Blizzard have had in a long-ass time. Hmm. And still 13k likes, 13k dislikes. Meaning, at least, if we go by this, uh, if, we, if we follow the logic of this, then at least 50% of the people who watch this video did not like this video. Calcor, how are you doing? Thank you for the follow, dude. Really appreciate that. Thank you, thank you, thank you. So, yeah. Calcor, happy to have you here, bro. Very happy to have you here. I think, I think at the end of the day, it's, it's, we'll see. Only many people liked it. True. That's why we screenshotted it now. Just to make sure that we never forget, right? In a year from now, I'll, I'll tweet out the screenshot and say, never forget. <laughs> I don't dislike, uh, I don't often, like, it's very rare for me to hit the dislike button on a video. Very rare. 